The Limestone County NAACP is collaborating with several businesses and first responders to host a special back to school event for the community. News 19 Sam Satamajani reports that the group and its sponsors want to do more than just offer school supplies. Organizers of the inaugural Back to School Career Day here say it's the generosity that helps build the Athens Limestone community where it's needed most and sets the tone for the rest of the school year. With the uh, pandemic and all that, the prices, uh, inflation is hidden. So people just don't have the funds to, to purchase. To ensure all kids in the area can get their school supplies, Lucita Jones from the Limestone County NAACP says local businesses pitched in to drop off items at Saturday's event. We hope to form a relationship and let the community know that we're here for them and we're going to be here. We're not going anywhere um, and we're forming relationships with all with all parties in the community. One integral resource is Athens Limestone County Public Library, which donated books and sign-up forms for its free year-long programs. As prices continue to rise and families are feeling a pinch, it's really, it's just a wonderful opportunity to be able to go to the library to cut out at least some expenses. We have computers, we have printing, we have Wi-Fi, we have faxing. So any sort of cost savings that families can have right now is beneficial. The event is also a chance for outreach from other causes like NAACP's voter registration and local law enforcement. Anytime you can be around young children, it is positive uh, to, to, to play the positive interaction with uh, law enforcement and, and the community is also a positive. Uh, I know most everybody here, uh, you know, and, and that, that's that's really awesome to get to come out and know people and, and be able to talk to people. In Athens, Samson Tamajani, News 19. And the Limestone County NAACP says that school-related donations are always welcome. So you can find the link to give on our website, whnt.com.